I don't give a shit what you wanted to talk to Landon, so well. I was done talking to him. I'm about to be done talking to you too, though. That's why you joined to talk to Landon? What do you think? I'm some. some I, I gotta get a finder's fee or something. Let me get a finder's fee. You're the one trying to pick me. I don't try to pick you out, but I gotta get some money first. I need $40. I was gonna tell Landon he needs a shave. <laughs> and I'm so, oh, so smooth with the shade, huh? No, oh, Landon, well, I, Landon's a, I mean, I don't care what you say. Landon's a good looking guy. I mean, straight up. He just is. Oh, you're dope. You said he's guys. Like, Michelle, you're, you're, again. Michelle he's, he has a fiance. I don't want him. I can't say somebody's good looking. Why would you say that to me? I don't give a shit what you think of his looks. Hey, happy I mean, Easter, Jeff. shave that fucking beard. He looks awful. I bet he doesn't care what you think about his beard. Hey, Sherry. That's an advice. Though. I wonder what his girlfriend thinks of his beard. Probably the same thing, right? Is that a common opinion? Women don't really like beards, do they? Hey, I'm like a. Hey, here we go. Turn off, my, turn off my camera, please. I'm like still waiting. Okay, hold, up. Wait, hold up. Hold on a second. Hold on. Ooh, hold up. Hold on. Hold on a second. Wait a minute. There we go. There we go. Hold up. Who was that? That's Lauren Delaguna. She's still here. So are you, Michelle. I'm trying to find a way to put the book on the thing. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Can I edit your camera? Let me see. Let me try. Um, why are you? I can leave back here. Okay. Lauren, you look so good right now. Jeez, Louise. No, I don't. I'm waking you up. Great That's chat. You have no bad. idea. You have great skin. Michelle, have you ever seen Lauren? Like, this is unbelievable. Yeah. It's that song. You know what's hilarious? People say about my face and my skin, right? Lauren's skin. Like, how would they feel if their kid had like acne and people like dog their kids? Hold on. Dude, <laughs> why did Michelle ever get that point? Hold on. I want to show. I want to show you. What if your kid? What if your kid had acne? What are you doing? You're in a bed. This is my favorite Michelle vs. character. I was up late last night. And I'm trying. I'm trying to wake up, but um, your grading voice is really helping. <laughs> it's, 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 that'll bring, bring you right back to the world. Thank you. I can't even hate on her, Michelle. You're like Michelle's kryptonite, Lauren. You always were. No, she wasn't. Like one and I were. Uh huh. Like, you got under your skin. This one right here did. Her yeah, and one of the. Contacted my ex-husband. Yeah, but, I, I don't. But he's know. a piece of shit to her. He talked to her so awful. Oh, Michelle, you're throwing Etienne under the bus now. <laughs> no, no we did. Lauren didn't. He, didn't he just we got, we got married and we fell in love and we had two beautiful babies. I remember that. That was, that was a, me <laughs> and Etienne. Oh yeah. Okay, sure. <laughs> you kept up with Michelle, little baby you know, ski mask and little baby Molly. Hey, one second. <laughs> I'm gonna Michelle, get the charger. My judgment to die. Let me yeah. plug it up real quick. Okay. Oh, imagine if you didn't have a place to plug it in. There you go. There you go. Michelle, you're like a homeless person. My phone's about to die. Yeah, Michelle, you have all the cords right there at your house. You can just. I, know, I just had to plug it up, like real quick. Yeah. Why don't you look peaceful? I I feel I feel at peace. How are you, Michelle? Doing good. <laughs> I, I miss. What do you think about Michelle? Like, how do, how do you have any observations or input for her? Advice? I'm doing great. I'm I'm doing great. Don't lead the witness, good. Michelle. Let her have a fair say. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead, Lauren. Uh, so I just want to know um, what you've been up to since we last spoke. Fucking I heard you working my ass off. Oh, really? You're working? You have a job? What are you doing? I um I cut boxes at Walmart in the distribution center for um other people to take products off of the boxes I cut. All right, I made a mistake. Hey, Lauren, how's it going? That's the distribution the cool. center. I've been great. I've been like, my uh, channel kind of did well. I've been like hanging out with some really cool people and having a huge party to uh, celebrate becoming an attorney on April 13th. I was going to ask oh, how you did. Did you finally get like. Finally. <laughs> no, no, I mean, no, it was a long story. I don't mean finally. Did you, uh, on try number 11, finally get it, Lauren? Are you finally a lawyer? Like, she's so young. No, I mean, she was going through some shit with the bar. Like, I was, uh, she's right. She's not, she's not. That's true. I'm like congratulating her. Thank oh, you. Okay. Yes, I was You're going through with the bar and now I'm no longer going through shit with the bar. Good. And, Good for you. What? Yeah, so you're a lawyer now. But you worked really hard. I mean, you no, don't watch. I'm let her talk, Michelle. And I remember you went through that. Michelle, let her speak. Can she, can she not answer the question for herself? Jeez, you're speaking all over. I'm not quite an attorney yet. I'm swearing in at the party. So one of my friends is. When is your party? April 13th. Do you want to come? What date is that? I mean, what date is that? you should go that? to it. She just invited you, Michelle. You should go to it. What date is it? It's on a Saturday. I'm off. Great. Yeah, come to come to Miami then. Get a really flight. Should. How far out is it? Like how far away from now? Well, fuck, it's okay. I'll come to Miami. Actually, I want to go to Miami. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll want to intrude on it. I'll just meet you out there in Miami. That'd be so much fun for Lauren and I to go like, go to go that party. like party. Right? That's like the only city in America that I haven't been to that I want to go to. Miami is like literally the only cool city that I haven't been to. And maybe Seattle. I've been to Miami a lot. South Beach is cool. Yeah. South Beach and Miami is cool, but Miami. So what else? So Michelle, hold on a second. What else, Lauren? What else? What else? So you got to. Yeah, are you seeing anybody? Are you still single? Like, what about that aspect? Everybody says I insult people. I don't. Michelle, quiet. I'm asking her important question. Michelle, I'm, I'm over here trying to ask her if she's single or not, and you're you're just fucking blabbathoning right over it. Why would you uh, give a shit? She wouldn't date you. I'm not asking for myself. Well, uh, I'm talking. She wouldn't date you either, Michelle. I don't get no, no ideas over there. I see the way you lean back. You've always, I've know, always felt the heat that you had for Lauren. Do you want me? Because like, um, you texted me one fourth. You have so like, much. I love you at midnight last night. What'd you just say? What'd you say? Say it again. You texted me. You have so much three. sexual frustration for Lauren Delaguna right now. It's ridiculous. You just want to go down on her and just oh live down. God, I like Lauren. What are you talking about? I can yeah, tell. You like her a lot. Like who would angel. No, that's, I don't think she's, that's what you're seeing when you look at her, Michelle. You're not looking at a little angel. Michelle, yeah, I am. Yeah, she's like resting in her bed. It was like her down <laughs> on her 
I have the same thing, Lauren. It does look quite heavenly, right? It's all white and glowing. Yeah, and she looks beautiful. Yeah, this yeah. is like apartment. I just moved in. I can't do shit on this camera. Like, I can't turn it around. I can't. I don't know what, why. Are you in what city? Uh, I'm in Miami. I live here in Miami now. Um, I do. Oh, so you're by like South Beach? Yeah, I. Uh, they, 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 I love South Beach. Was... Friends with like a bunch of streamers down here. Oh, and... like popular people, like big channel people. Yeah, shit. huge channel people, like huge, wow. like Destiny That's... and Fresh. Well, look me up, girl. I'm joking. Uh, I'm, yeah, yeah, like, you think you're in the same league as Lauren Delaguna here? They're gonna go hang out with the streamer dudes. Like they're hanging out with uh, Lauren and I shit. actually were really good friends. But yeah, you're not in the same cloud caliber of, of attractive. But, so, so, but do you remember why we stopped being friends? I know, and I don't want to bring that up again. Why? Why is it? Uh, why do y'all stop? He contacted my ex-husband. You just already brought that up. Wait, hold on. Michelle, it's because I did something I wrong. You're worried about me. I did what? You're worried about me. I understand. No, no, no. I, I was wondering. You think that our friendship ended because I did something wrong? Um, it pissed me off that you contacted my ex-husband and you were, I think like, you were more pissed off that he him, her. And he basically told you, he talked to you like a whore. He was and trying to hit on her, Michelle, and I think that's what really got me. He wasn't but hitting I, on her. Michelle, no, he wasn't. Michelle. He was like, I want to bend you over and fuck you. Like, it was. What do you think they're talking about there? Yeah, that's no, definitely, he, like, he was, he, Michelle, he was making an overture. He was making a run. That's not ATN. Like, oh. ATN was being very disrespectful to Lauren. Michelle, I have Do you remember Coping. why? Coping. Do you remember why I contacted ATN? Yeah, because of my fake stroke. Oh, so it's my fault that you contacted me for three days pretending to have a stroke no but it's your fault for contacting yes. my ex-husband after he said he wouldn't, Michelle, over wouldn't have done that if you hadn't faked a stroke again you were hey, i'm being nice to you like you want to so, bring up the old do you want to bring up old times or do you want to be like congratulated that you're getting like finally you're gonna be an attorney finally she wants to, she wants to clean up, yeah she wants to clean up how y'all parted ways michelle lauren like i uh i'm doing good that's so good i'm glad i'm happy for you i'm just glad it's going well yeah no. i think i work Hey, Michelle, uh -huh. What about her, Michelle? Are you glad that she's getting married and she's living in a nice apartment? I just apartment? said that. I was like, I'm so proud of you. Like, you everybody, for... like if it's on a Saturday, look. Um, look at her skin, Michelle. Like, her skin is like gorgeous right now. Michelle, you're envying her skin. Right, right, right. Hey, Michelle, look at that, turn off the look at that skin, Michelle. Jeez, look, please. Do what? Do you envy that skin? I mean, I, like, as a woman, looking at her on the screen, are you like a little. She's uh, beautiful. I've always said that about her. Absolutely. I'm 50. She's like 20 something. Uh, same oh, thing. You didn't look like that. You're how old? 20. You're turning 30? No, I'm in my 30s. Oh, you're in your 30s. Michelle, you weren't looking like that in your 30s. The fuck, I wasn't. <laughs> Michelle, you think it's an age thing only? I don't think so. She's the only thing about people saying I age too much is that AT and I split up and he stopped paying for Botox in Restaurant. Well, I've never, never, I've never, never Botox. once had Botox. I've never no. once had Botox. I've never once had any surgery. I've never had like well, yeah, but you don't need fillers. it. You're never. young. I never did any of that until I was like in my late forties. So, but we were talking forties. And yeah, the jury's out on that one, Michelle. I think that she's stunning even you. you know. She's amazingly just, beautiful. I'm saying so that. Well, Don, you look amazing. How many fucking times <laughs> do I have to say that? Um, seven. Okay. You look amazing. 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 She's hot. Oh my. Appreciate it. She'll bring up the fake stroke. That was quite a little side story in the in the. Ah, she's Lawrence. I forgot about that. I actually forgot about that till just now. The fake stroke. That's that's legendary lore right there, Michelle. What do you think? Like flavor with her fake cancer, and she scammed like right. I mean, I don't want to bring up shit on me, but like you never ever talk. You never talk about other YouTubers. Who, who, this is a rare Lauren like Delaguna appearance. I haven't talked to Lauren Delaguna in like over a year, but like a long time. No, I haven't seen you in forever. Like I said, you look beautiful. This is, yeah, why, why, why crowbar flavor in there? I don't know. You crowbarred in a 3,000 subscriber YouTuber. This lady hangs out with whoever the hell Destiny is, Michelle. I, that's fine. I don't know Destiny. I don't, I don't need to put so his name. He's the biggest streamer. Uh, kicks, well, he has like a $3 million kick contract. Um, he's one of the biggest streamers in the world. Uh, is your apartment upstairs right there? No, this is, oh, I can't turn on my camera, but this is my apartment. Um, no, that's, 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 like my, that's my studio. That's my chess board. That's my you play chess. Yeah, that's chess. awesome. I've never learned how to play chess, but um, Joseph's dad used to be really good at chess, and so he taught Joseph how to play chess. Awesome. It's just something I never got into. Like, Lauren, what are you doing for Easter today? Um, I'm getting lunch with a couple of friends, but they're out. Um, they're out <laughs> doing Instagram stuff right now. And I can I like I'm a social media influencer. Uh, do you yeah. Know you do right now, really good. Actually, you look better now than I've ever seen you in my entire life. She's at the top of her game right now. She's, she's, a, she's at a high yeah, level. I mean, I'm just saying, like, everybody says I don't We're not making a film uncomfortable with you. It's not a meat market. Lord, I'm, Michelle, I'm telling you, I can feel the energy. Michelle, she's, she's not she's not digging you in that way to back off. No. She's not into chicks. She's marrying into I don't want. I'm not into chicks. Where's face, Michelle? Let's not make our guests feel uncomfortable. You're being I take it out. Look at Michelle. You made her turn the damn camera off. Damn it, Michelle. Look what you've done. You made the pretty chick in the car and drive away. I just her. I just want to tell her hi. She looks beautiful. <laughs> Michelle, I didn't know what she looks like now. She turned the camera off. Well, she looks uh, beautiful and she looks better than I think I've ever seen her in her entire oh, yeah, life. So Lauren's doing well. Absolutely, I agree. I agree with that statement. She looks amazing. Let me turn the DVR back on because I was high. I don't know why that's not on. We can um I can show you. Hey, beautiful. She came back. Oh, good. You look right. so good. Like, you look amazing. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Come on, You're welcome. She needs so much coming from you, Michelle. It's like the best compliment ever. She's oh, damn, you do look good. I didn't see you. Whoa. We have like a night. Is that like a 90 or whatever? Like a little... No, it's like a. 
Oh, you swaggy. Like a mini yeah. dress. It's like a mini dress for people that are younger. That's pretty tight. Pretty cool. You look nice in that. What do you do for your hair? You guys just don't even have to do anything really. You can go out like that. Got it's nice a hair. Rat nest right now, but <laughs> yeah, I was about to say like. That's okay, Michelle. Daddy gets a bad nest. Look, I got like four inches cut off from my hair, Lauren. No way. We're so unhealthy, huh? So no way. Yeah, I've got it. It feels weird that I have short hair. Let's see it. It's there. Like it's short. It was like down to here. Wow. Yeah. Um, I used to grew it out. Huh? I used to have, but I grew it out. Yeah, I was growing my hair out too, but you gotta do the you gotta do the interim thing. What's that? So it stays healthy. Well, oh, it, cut off the dead ends or whatever the dry. Yeah, yeah. Right. That's why I had to get too much fucking hair cut off of me because I was growing my hair out, right? right? Too much. But then the ends get stringy and you get split ends, right? You look very tall. How tall are you, Lauren? Like five eight or something? Five nine? Oh I no, think five seven. Five five. Yeah. I would like to be the angle. Yeah. Do you want her? Hey, Lauren, you still have my phone number, right? What? You have my phone number. Do I have your phone number? I think you blocked. You look so good. Yeah, That's good morning. Like, I think I might have blocked you or something, right? Well, yeah, you, you could be a model. You, you should. It's crazy. Like if you would have uh, been like, less intelligent, you probably would have been like, you hate on all the women on ski. I don't know. I don't. Michelle, I'm trying to. I'm trying to give her a compliment. If she would have been less intelligent and, and more dim with it, she could have been a model. Yeah, she, she had like that look, you know. Oh yeah, she could definitely be a model. Modeling yeah. It takes like yeah, modeling features. is very tough. I mean, you have to go through agents. Right, right, right. You know what I'm talking about. You have to get like an agent, and then you have to like do this and do this and do this for free, so that people like see beautiful. who you are. And Look then you get like a hair paying gig. Like, yeah, it's Look at hair volume. No, it's it, not, not good right now. But that's my lines are ridiculous. Wake up and get ready you for. Thanks, nice. thanks for coming on the panel, Lauren. It's good to talk to you. Hey, Lauren. You. Um, give me a call, and if Locked. my number, I don't, I don't know. Doctor, my number. Doctor. So, I don't know, use a different, use a Google voice number to contact me. <laughs> you got to go through all that. Man, this is Lauren Delhi. I don't know that I blocked Ten times as popular as you've ever been on your best day, Michelle. She's doing the, doing the favor. I would absolutely love to go to, no, I would absolutely love to go down and party with you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's April. No, seriously. Like, it'd be so much fun. I, we're, I'm be swearing in at the 11 Club. So. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what the 11 Club is. But Michelle, chat's saying that you were never a model, Michelle. I don't know anything about that. Were you a model? I don't know about that. Sorry. Modeling is really hard. I did. Um, you were a model? How do you know? DH, DH Homes. I think they went out of business like a long, long time ago. You were a model, Michelle? Who? Yeah. Mean, what? I've never heard of this. I didn't know this. There were pictures and shit. Like, what'd you model? What kind of clothes for the department store. But like for like print modeling, like you were in magazine ads or what? You on like TV? No, they closed for their department store when they like did their. You know what I went, Lauren? Like when they like released their new line. I, I was a I was a fit model, but I was never like an actual model. No, me neither. That's what I'm saying. Like you know, like sure, when, me neither. No, no. Hold on, that's a really particular class of model. It's not someone that actually displays the clothing. It's somebody who is. Yes, a I did. I like wore clothing for the department <laughs> store and like showed their new release lines or whatever. I'm calling. I'm calling the BS meter going off the charts over here, Michelle. My BS radar. I was like 14, 15, 16 years old when I did that. BS meter. Fit model. As a fit model, I had to like maintain like a certain figure, and then as designers. So when designers design clothes, they typically design it for the smallest size, and then they. No, they don't. <laughs> No, they don't go shopping like any mall. I wear like zeros. I like wear zeros and double zeros. And so what? the way they explained it to me at the Gap a long time ago is that they order clothes like for certain size people. So if you don't go buy like the new items as soon as they go on sale, like in zeros, they might order like three or four or five or six or seven zeros. Okay, order. And then they order more sixes and then they more. Did you get a word in Edward? Let, let Lauren interject something here. Let's have a conversation. No, no. She if she's small, she understands. Like you nope. can't find cute clothes in zeros. <laughs> Ordering is different than designing when designers design clothes. So they don't typically design for all sizes simultaneously. They design for the smallest si size first, and then they ratchet it up for the rest of the sizes by changing the pattern. Just right. like that works. So as a fit model, all I was supposed to do was literally go into the private studio where the designing the designer's new outfit, see what's wrong with it so that they can make adjustments and send it back to the factory with you. Oh, that's awesome. It's not like a no, that's awesome. Like there was never any pictures of me. It wasn't like I was on a runway. It wasn't like Yeah, I did like dumb. <laughs> Stupid runway, but like for like a department store, like showing their newest shit, right? And when clothes that they sold. I've never heard of like a department store model, but uh, D H Homes, they're not even in business anymore. But um, yeah, like they show their new line of products, so people buy them. I mean, it wasn't this huge modeling thing. It was like I don't know, I, I was like sixteen years old. <laughs> I'm fifty. Like I'm fifty now, right? But I was, How are you sure this wasn't like a dream or something, Michelle? You, did you get paid for this? Like, was it a job? Like, did you get money? Um, my mom did. I'm not on her nice good. breast. Oh, she's not on her breast. Why do you speak on her, on her, her body? She like leaned that? over on her boob on that. Michelle, not everyone's looking at her like, a, like it's a meat factory. She's not a meat factory. She's beautiful. I'm telling you, Michelle, you got a thing for it. And there's nothing wrong with that. I'm trying to I'm keep sure that in the girls. My ring's a little. <laughs> I didn't say you worry, but you're in the, you're in the Lauren. Because <laughs> I, I like her as a person. Oh, check it out. Yes, but... oh, yeah. Look at the layout. Oh, there we go. 
on the clock. Oh, what kind of dog is that there? This is Hugo Boss. Boss. <laughs> Hugo Boss. What time? Uh, just a little mutt. Get He's free a mutt. All right, one or two are here. Yeah. In Miami. Miami. Damn, that's why. Oh, it is Miami, honey. I just said that because I've seen them in hotels. Oh, that looks like Miami to me. Oh, damn, you're, hell, you're super high. A 24 type deal. On the second floor. What floor? Young. 32. That's high. How many are on there? How many? Well, maybe don't tell me. They must stop carrying groceries up, though. Uh, I mean, we have elevators, so. Well, I understand uh, that, but you still have to, like. And also, most of the time, we just deliver groceries, so. Yeah, yeah so I live in the middle of nowhere, so I don't even get. Uber oh, yeah, she's lives in the, she just showed you where she lives in the damn high rise in Miami. Like, she's not delivering. Her place is beautiful. Groceries. Like, I have not said anything. Ski, you try to start shit with people. I'm not trying to start them. You just yeah, you're no, over here comparing everything. I'm negative about Lauren, and you just keep saying that I'm putting her down, and I'm not. I never said you put her down at all. Who said anything about putting her down? You're, you're lashing out at me. What's the deal? What's the problem? I'm not lashing out at me just now. I gotta go, because I gotta go. <laughs> I gotta go, You stay here for a second. I'll be right back, guys. You, y'all. Mich- well, girly, I still want to do my interview with you. Are you down? I'll fucking fly to Miami for your, like, legit. Like, I'll fly to Miami for your party. Okay, well, it's on the 13th. It's an all-day event. We're doing... So, you need... Yeah, I'm off on Saturday, Sunday, Monday. I'm off three days a week. Yeah, so, it's... Legit, I will fly in. Like, that would be so much fun. Yeah, we're doing... We're starting with brunch, and then we're going to be going to the Paradox So, can I stay there, or do I have to get a hotel? I'm just asking. Uh, you don't have to get a hotel. What a tasteless, rude question. She's not going to take I'm going to come in for a thing, and we're friends, like... Can I stay at your place or do I have to get an Airbnb? I'm just asking about finances. I suppose you could stay on the couch. I don't my know. My goodness, company. Michelle. Way to crowbar your, crowbar your way in there. I'm not oh. crowbarring my way into anything. Legit. Like, I'm happy for her. She's, like, fought for her attorney thing forever. Yeah. I have a poodle. Yeah, it's my roommate, Doggy. Are you a roommate? Yeah, she's awesome. Yeah, I do in the other states, but apparently she's not lying. You cannot go to her house. She has a roommate. She does not want to have to ask her roommate's opinion. Or, or, oh, my God. Uh, Whatever. I'm not weird. Lauren and I have talked so much. You are so, completely into Lauren. She's getting married to a man. Lauren, she's beautiful. Not. I'm glad she's getting married. She's Thank getting married to a Thanks. I appreciate yeah, it. You. Congratulations. And Thank you me. want to go stay on her? Michelle, that ain't, that's not very gracious. Get your damn hotel for, for a night. Her roommate is obviously not the man that she's marrying. My roommate, but that's correct. And also, I'm already married, so that's... You're married? Your roommate's already married? Where's her husband? They don't live together? I'm at work uh, or something? Like, I guess, like, never mind. No. It makes sense. And I forgot I, who I was talking to here. <laughs> Sorry. And yeah, and well, I wanted to finish telling you about my party because it's epic. So first, yeah. brunch, and then Paradox Museum, which is like a cool place for pictures. And then we're gonna have um, dinner prepared by Destiny's private chef. And then we're gonna swear in at eleven. Um, oh, yeah, I, I, like I really wanna, like I wanna, like we, like you, and, Michelle's trying to, had a weird relationship. She's trying to gold dig, Lauren. Let me break it down to you. Michelle's trying to mingle with these single. Dominican. No, I'm not. Oh my god. I don't even know about who she has coming to. Oh come on, Michelle. You like, definitely probably know who this person is. There I'd be there. I have like some of the coolest people coming to this party. I'm like literally so excited. Um uh, it's it's gonna be great. It's yeah, like okay. Is so, it not gonna be awkward? You can't really invite Michelle. Did you invite Michelle seriously? Or did you make- um it's gonna be a huge fucking party. It's not like I'll notice pretty much. Mm, why would it be awkward? Like Lauren and I were actually good friends for a while. You can come to me. I'm sorry to say shit to you. He can come too. Good both. I like Tara. I, are you not friends with Tara, Michelle? I know I knew I know you aren't. Lauren, fix your top. Your top is fine. No, Lauren, she don't listen to her. She's just trying to. Oh, your babies. That better. Oh. There you go, Michelle. <laughs> yeah, that's much better. That, I mean, you're really good. You got a nice physique. You said you did fit modeling. I've never said like, anything uh, ugly about her looks or anything ever. Michelle, I'm talking to her again. Could you let me bring my damn face? Beautiful. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm trying to tell her also. You're stepping all over like my. Everybody uh, always face. says she attacks people on Ski's chat that are women. Yeah, how, how could you attack her? There's, there's, there's no, name. there's no, you have no ammunition. You couldn't attack her if you wanted to. But, I, but I'm. Pretty intelligent women are like kryptonite to you, Michelle. You're crumbling right now. I'm not crumbling. I can't think of another Lauren, one. Like I'm right. crumbling. Don't ask Lauren. And Lauren, I'm just making an observation. I'm the objective, I'm objective like, observer. Like, God, oh my God, get a life. Get a Michelle, job. Michelle, I... <laughs> Did you tell me to get a life or get a job? Michelle, you're crumbling. You're attacking me now? <laughs> well, you're trying to attack me, and I'm just complimenting Lauren, right? Oh, shit. I'm going to sit back here. My fault. Yeah, why don't you sit back and yeah, take a seat. <laughs> take several seats, Ski. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah. Sorry, you look amazing, and congratulations. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. What what else is new with you, Michelle? Um, I see that you're still in the same house. Are you planning on moving? I mean, when it sells, but it's like I'm, I'm not even gonna explain AT and I's relationship, right? <laughs> Please bear with me, because like, it's so fucking crazy. But no, the house hasn't even been listed. Dude, but again, last May I was supposed to be evicted. Right? Are <laughs> you gonna make her go back to sleep with this boring ass story? <laughs> You no, could, no, no, she's catching up. She's asking questions. You could be evicted unless, like, it's not selling and you've initiated Swatter's rights. I don't know. Oh, I, I've that. not done that. <laughs> but my name is on the title. What is it? Is that a title? Is it, it's a deed or something, right? You're not called no, a title, my right? name is on the title of the house. I'm just not responsible for the mortgage. I own half of this house. Nice. Lauren, you're like an attorney. You know what I'm talking about. I, yeah. 
you're talking right, right, right. <laughs> just because you have your name on the title doesn't mean that the well, I don't have the house so half the equity is mine right but that doesn't mean that the house hasn't been seized by the bank if you like stop paying your mortgage or if you stop no, no 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 atm pays a mortgage it gets it, it gets like out of his automatic checking account let me ask you a question lauren so if, if a dude came up to you and somehow said, I make 12000 a month, you wouldn't be like blown away. It's not like a, that's well, not even you really know a what? I don't give a fuck what you say. I'm asking Lauren a question that has to do with you, Michelle. How much a money a month do you make, Ski? Like, oh, I'm asking Lauren a question. No, seriously, okay. I'm so sorry that my ex husband is a retired military and then he got 100% disability and then he got a job working for SEIC making 100000 a year. Wait, yeah, he brought in 12000 a month. That's a lot of fun. You're talking over Lauren. We can't hear you because her damn mic's so overbearing. Sorry, Lauren. What was that? Uh, how much does he make with 100% disability? Do you know how much the government pays him for that? Um, I think he makes like sixty seven hundred with his, yeah, yeah, yeah. With his <laughs> he's not alone. He's not on SSDI. I'm sorry. Because of the government, and I get. But paid. you're not letting me talk. He's not on government money. So you just said he was. You just said he when got. When you retire out of the military, when you retire out of the military, the military will give you disability. It has nothing so, to do with SSDI or anything like that. The military pays you like I don't know. They gave him like a thousand for his fucking feet because he wore army boots all the time. They gave him like I don't know another six hundred dollars because he worked artillery and he shot guns. So hold on, hold on, hold on. But yeah, when first you of all, the army, like Lauren, but I first of all, but you don't know anything. About why are you revealing this personal information that has nothing to do with anything she says? Well, she's asking about the twelve thousand. You know that I was in the Air Force, right? And I currently I brought up the twelve thousand. Sorry, Lauren, one last second. I brought up the twelve thousand. I was asking her a question. Why I don't know why you're so personally offended by the number twelve thousand? What does that have anything to do with you? Indian makes probably how does sixty seven hundred. What are we, what are, I'm asking her, her hypothetically about a random so person. I don't care about eighteen sixty-seven hundred. Sixty-seven hundred dollars a month to stay home and do nothing. Sixty-seven hundred dollars a month is even less than twelve thousand. Michelle, what universe are you he in? He quit his job. <laughs> don't tell Etienne's business. His new girlfriend's in the chat. His old girlfriend's on the screen. Oh my god, whatever. Fiance. Yeah, he had a fiance. She's on the screen. Yeah, I know. I, my fiance. He gave me that huge ring. Remember? Remember the ring, Michelle? That was funny. It was humongous too. It was like as big as a damn softball. Oh, I don't know, but I mean, Lauren, you don't remember that? You don't recall that bit? Beach, right? So it's like where you live and the people that you meet. I mean, like I said a long time ago, if you date doctors and lawyers, you're gonna marry a doctor or lawyer. If you like date we don't have, we don't even know what then you're gonna get married to shitty bars come. We don't so, even know what marriage, like, guy is. He's probably so a, you're 100% disabled, you get paid $3,737.85. Again, Boom. plus his retirement. And he was a Boom. major and he retired from the army. Boom. Uh, Bam. Oh, I can Bam, add that up. Boom, Michelle, those are zeros and zeros. Plus zeros. No, Aiken gets like 6,700 a month right now. Oh, Google it, darling. I, I'm on Google. What do you think I'm doing? Yeah, so how much does a major get paid with 20 years retirement? You think you can Google like, it? Yeah, Google it, Lauren. He makes like 6700 a month right now for sitting home doing nothing. And then well, when he it's a, it's a, it's like he married, he made another like 110000 on top. I was asking Lauren. Lauren, Lauren I'm shocked on. because I'm telling the truth. I want to ask her. Uh, hey, what's up, B-Rando? Uh, I want to ask Lauren. Lauren. Would, she be, would she feel like wooed out of her socks and, and just like awestruck at the fact that her potential husband made... Sixty-seven hundred is the new, the new number you're going with. It would. It would. That's how much he gets now. He, he gets I bet she's going to feel secure. And he gets one hundred percent disability from the military, not disability. No wonder he has to live at home. No what wonder it makes sense. Oh, all that what? trash you talk about me. He lives at home. You, you stole his house from him. You don't. Need, God, he, 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 he fucking left me. He left me the house. Dumbass. He did. I don't think he left you the house. I think he just like left left you and you were still in the house, kind of for a bit. I mean, I like, wasn't even home when he left. But you've seen him a hundred times since then. So I mean, he's back over there. I haven't seen him a hundred times since then. When was he sharpening that damn sword and looking all crazy in the kitchen? Uh, that's when we're married. Oh, that's an old video. Yeah. Oh my God! Don't. Why do people release that shit out of context? I thought that was a new video. He just came back over there. Yeah, he was like, like four years old, and I still have the. Oh, can we get a little context yeah, with these videos? That was too so important to him. The sword is still on our mantle. Where did I see that video at? I just saw that video like a week or two ago. He was like going nuts. He was like sharpening. But how did that video come to the only surface? way that you could um kill someone according to Syrian law is to behead them. Like yeah, he was going nuts. He was going nuts. He was fucking drunk and he's going nuts. And, and then who released the video? Lauren. See, Lauren's doing it right. So you released the video, Lauren. She she looking right now. Give her a second. A month in retirement. I figured. Now she's looking. I know. I have to calculate it. All right. Yeah. You make sixty-seven hundred a month. <laughs> um, then we get to run. Calculate it. That's how much he's he makes right now, and he's living with his mother for free. Hold on. Answer. Go ahead. He gets seven hundred a month. Sixty-seven. How much? Sixty-seven. Give it if uh, if he's getting if he was a major and he retired after twenty years of service, he would take his full how much he got paid at his maximum amount. Which was sixty nine thousand dollars and oh, are you crazy? Etienne made over hundred. Etienne made over hundred thousand dollars as a major. Why don't you Google that? Are no, you, Michelle, she's, she's running the numbers right now. I'm giving you compliments, and now you're like showing that you're stupid. No, <laughs> I mean I'm not trying to be rude. Like I'm, I'm very rude. Go kick it, but like Michelle, that's very rude. rude. What do you mean <laughs> you're not trying to be rude? Okay, right now. Okay, I let like, me like you sound stupid because I've got pay stubs. I just Michelle, better finish your thought. So, so I'm looking at a major. 20 years retired, and Etienne made over 100000 a year when he was a major. 
in oh. the army. Um, yeah, look at the pay scales. I'm he retired as an 04. He was Give her a second to get her thought out, Michelle. She's putting the numbers together. Like he's wrong. Like Jane even said nothing yet. Congratulations on being an attorney, but you don't like know how to do research. What you? I'm literally. She's doing it right now in real time. What do you mean? Right now. I, I'll do it too. I have this number because I did. Yeah, let me see you do it on the phone, Michelle, or whatever, and then we'll see. Taking need of 110,000 a year as a major in the army. Even if okay, but first of all, my calculation is probably closer to six seven with the number that I used than the number. Are you, you crazy? ATN made over one hundred and ten thousand a year as a major in the army. Okay, let me just take that number then. Oh, okay. First of all, that's not what Google is saying, but no, let's I'm, I'm telling you how much he made. Like, I'm not lying to you. I don't give a fuck because he's not. Michelle, you told her to look at Google. Sorry, you told her to Google it, and this is what she did. Now she's coming back with the numbers, and you're just what? Are you saying he made sixty nine thousand? So why don't you um Google a staff sergeant salary? I'm, oh, I'm, wait, wait, hold on, Michelle. Well, hold on, like what's seventy or eighty thousand a year. And is Google random shit now? Max for a staff sergeant, according to this. How much does a staff sergeant make? Like one thousand. How much? Five one zero zero zero. And ATN was a major, oh four when he retired. Wait, where did he go to college? Um, Alabama, something state. He um he actually did his GI Bill, and he got his master's in foreign relations before he even went into the army. So as soon as he went into the army, he was a commissioned officer. Mm, do your research, Lauren. Well, how can I do my research on your husband's educational background? Well, I mean, you're asking questions, so I'm telling you. Okay, so, so I, he was he went when he went into the army. He was a commissioned officer, and ATN made over a hundred thousand a year. And I'm not seeing a hundred thousand a year, but I'm gonna. Was go he like, do, was he maybe selling cocaine on the side himself? Was he perhaps doing some illegal, uh, like, <laughs> was he importing cigarettes at, like a, without paying taxes? Oh my God, no. ATN's never the only time ATN's ever done drugs. Was he selling illegal firearms? Like, Mexican, I convinced him a couple times to smoke pot with me. Wow. Did he have connections with the Mexicans? No, he's clean as shit. I mean, that's the people they want. All right, I'll leave that alone. It's a joke. Maybe he's a guy, and we just didn't work out. If, no, he's not even trying to bend over Lauren whenever you guys were going through your divorce. He no, he didn't. He was talking dirty to her to piss her off. Oh, not to, pit, to piss her off. But he's bitten. <laughs> that's like Daffy Duck over here. How, how disrespectful was he to you, Lauren? Uh, he really seemed to want my pussy. He did. He was very descriptive. It was, was kind of hot. Yeah, so. he said, I'm going to bend you over the bed and fuck you in the ass really hard. I still have the cats. Yeah, it felt really good when he did it, too. He's never been with my ex husband, stupid bitch. Ooh, yeah. Yeah. I guarantee you, I guarantee mm -hmm. you, you've never fucked ATN. Oh, it was great, actually. You're telling, you're trying to tell the world about how rich and great he was. Are you, Michelle, are you claiming that you don't think he would hook up with her? He took me out for a nice, nice dinner. Where'd you go? And then, yeah. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? To, quick, 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 quick. Where'd you go? Forte de Marme. Where? Forte de Marme. In New Orleans? No, in Miami. Yeah, ATN's not gone to see you in Miami. You're full of He came out of pocket, Michelle. He, ooh, look at that. Michelle, okay, come on I was now. trying to be nice to you and saying, like, I wanted to come, like, hang out with you and celebrate your... <laughs> but now you're just being a cunt. Come hang out with a hundred percent. A hundred percent. Why would you just completely? I mean, of course he had. Why would she? She's, she's sitting here lying because a hundred percent. I know that ATN is That's never crazy. Seen you. Me? Why would she lie? Yeah. Yeah. ATN's never seen you. I'm why is she trash? She talks to you like a whore. I would never. I can't he believe. Talk to you like a whore. No. Well, he treated me like one too. That's how he was trying to sweet talk her, Michelle. Oh, he treated her like one. Okay, like, no, Michelle. Oh, I, I just like everyone. Like, I was actually trying to be nice to you, right? Nope. We're sisters. And now you're making digs about my ex-husband, and I know that my ex-husband was never with you. We're we're sisters, Michelle. We're Eskimo sisters, and we should be proud of that. Also, like you should post like pictures of you and Etienne together. I mean, would no, you, why would you do that? Wouldn't why you take you? pictures if he took you to all these nice restaurants? We wouldn't you take pictures with my ex-husband. You're full of shit. Yeah, I posted them already. Remember with the ring and the children? No, I never saw that. I don't watch her live, and he doesn't have children. He hates kids. No, he had kids with me. <laughs> they got kids, Michelle. It's been quite a while. Yeah, got, so in like three years, you have children. Twins. They have twins, Michelle, and she's extremely fit to uh, bounce back like that. My, my uh -huh. tongue's not now. Sorry. Um, Etienne, like, can't Michelle, you, you know, were bragging on your body. I'm not going yeah. to disrespect my ex-husband because I love him. She had, he disrespected her, and, and she enjoyed it is what we're kind of getting at. Well, then I guess she likes being treated like a whore. Yeah, especially I mean, when especially he told her you want to bend her over the bed and fuck her in the ass. Because so, yeah, it was great. Did he do that with you, Michelle? Is that like? Did he, is that I'm like gonna a... log off and I'm gonna send this to um ATN right now, Lauren. Aww. <laughs> okay, my hi, honey, love you, babe. <laughs> You're gonna hook him up again, Michelle. He's gonna end up out there. Well, she's never been with her. You wouldn't touch her. She, I'm not again, but she can marry also. So it's like. Oh, if, she, oh, if you're pregnant with twins from him, where she has twins already. From? And she already has. And twins. why did you have to look on a computer to see how much money he made if you got pregnant and had twins I'm with him? I'm glad why I did you have to Google how much money ATN makes because I know how much he makes. How much he made so that I could increase my monthly allowance from him. He's been such a great little sugar daddy. It's been nice getting my full of shit. All right, whatever. Like Lauren, okay, I tried to be nice to you. And I was like, hey, I'll play to Miami for your party. But you're just a fucking cunt. Oh no! Oh my God! Did I say that? Much about your opinion. That really. My ex husband. Michelle, this is a nice chick. Hey, Lauren, I apologize. Thank you for my coming on my show. My husband would never touch you. Michelle, this is my oh. show. Oh. He nice spoke to you like a whore, and he treated you like a whore, and that is. So you know they did it back to you. Ever had so. with my ex husband, Lauren? Yeah, he he treated me like a whore in all the right ways. Yeah, so we got well, that. That's good.
That's okay. We agree upon that. Real. I don't give a fuck. I've you been divorced. Care right? a little bit though, because you're over here like fired up. We were having a good combo. Never met my ex-husband, my ex never met my ex-husband even in person. You've never met Etienne. You're a lying little whore. I, I, I'm gonna I, send this. I'm gonna clip this and send this to Etienne. Yeah. Right? Yeah. I, and he's gonna say that you're a lying piece of shit. Hey, hi Etienne. Nice to see you again. Hope you see this clip, hun. Our kids miss you. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna like. I'm going to send this to Etienne. This is hilarious. <laughs> what the hell is that gonna do, Michelle? You're gonna laugh or something? If your kids miss you, then Judy would be up your ass. Judy, you don't even know what I'm talking about. She's so far up my ass. I like really can't wait to get her out. So that. <laughs> Oh, good. I'm gonna send that to ATN too. Michelle, I'm, I'm, there's a lot of like. Okay, I'm, go. I'm going to lunch with my. Oh, friends. no, you rage quit. Rage quit. Her friends rage too. Quit. Hey, rage who quit. are your friends that you're going to lunch with? None of your fucking business. I was, why not? You tell us everything, Michelle. Come on, we're sharing. We're sharing I'm a lot. I'm not getting docs anymore. Like, I'm dating what? someone and you'll never know who I'm dating. Wait, can you tell me about that? <laughs> you're dating someone now, Michelle. When did this start? And now you're. <laughs> you just. Uh, and damn, Lauren, bro, like, I went, I went to like therapy and stuff, right? You're being a cunt, and I'm trying to be nice. To her. I never did tell you in therapy to call people to see you next Tuesday. No, I'm trying to be nice to her, and she's you're like, like, oh, you trying to be nice to you ever were. You've yeah, given okay. up on trying to be nice that much is evident. Show your babies, Lauren. Show the kids. She, what? Hell no. She I, you have than a that. roommate. Disgusting you suggestion. After all, there's no kid talk over here. This is one of my babies. That's not one of the Outrageous. Why would you want to dox yourself? I on Etienne, so I have one. Like, why would someone want to say where their children lived? Little baby ski mask. How are you? What's up, buddy? Weird that you entered. Like you, like. Named your dog little baby ski mask. Yeah, that's totally what I did. <laughs> you're like really weird. I was trying to be nice to you, and I was actually not playing. You were trying to be nice to her, Michelle. Like you're doing her a favor. You were just a toxic. No, I was actually gonna fly to Miami and be nice to her, but Mom's a baby. We're gonna fly to Miami and you want to stay on her couch. My ex-husband has never touched you. I promise you that. <laughs> How do you know? How can you promise her that? Come to Miami. I get. I used to go to South Beach like um once a year. Okay, come back. It'd be great to visit. <laughs> she don't know about. She's fuming smoke over here. She don't know about. I just put a cigarette out. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm a smoker. Oh my god. I'm a smoker. Hello. I would love to have her at my party. It would be such a great time. How has therapy been going, Michelle? It's been going really well. Is yeah. It digital, like telemedicine. Or do you have no, to go I'm to doing good. Like I, I know I'm doing good. I feel yeah. better. Michelle, don't take everything so personal. We're having a good talk here. This is, this is no, no. Thing. She started with ATN and twins and bullshit. ATN wouldn't touch you. You saying I started it? You said you have twins for my ex-husband. I do have twins with your ex-husband. <laughs> so what's the problem, Michelle? Share the twins. I, I <laughs> don't know the twins. Keep on. Michelle showed the twins on, on screen before. The two McCann twins. <laughs> I can't never pay for a boob job for her. I can tell. You should have got you a real. He's you know, fucking cheap. He's our parents. Oh. So he's cheap. Nice. Those are nice. nice. Michelle, if you, you wouldn't even, I mean, don't ever get them. Please, Lauren, don't ever get implants. It's like rare for a chick to be slim, petite, and, and like have your, your uh, physique. How much you weigh, Lauren? Uh -oh. okay, I'm 100 pounds and five foot five. You what? One, I'm 150 pounds and I'm five foot five. And 150? 15, five. Dumb, Dumbo over there, you got 150. I'm five six and I'm like 108. I'm 150, I'm Michelle, you have- you, You're out with pounds, how tall are you? Me? I'm Michelle. five, Michelle, oh. I'm tall. Oh, me, I'm not trying to get myself in the company. I'm five ten and 155. I'm like slim like you are, right? How tall are you, Michelle? No, I'm five six. Michelle, five, look at her shoulders. You're an inch taller than me and you weigh less than me, so you're thinner than me. That's very impressive. Thank you. Why don't you look better? Why does your body not look as good as her, Michelle? What is that all about? Because uh, Lauren grew up in Laguna Beach with rich parents, and they give her everything she fucking wants. Wait, whoa! No. Wait, Wait, that was a perfect direction. What's that got to do with like? Geez, you mean she's pampered and like? Exactly, she pampers herself all the time, and I don't. I, I do. I do like to to eat well. I, mean, you her, you know? I eat very well. Uh, There's plenty of rich people that have squandered it in their evil. I eat very well. I eat very well. You rarely see me ever eat sweets. There's no junk food in my house Ooh. at all right now. I well, it's just because men keep sending me gift baskets like your husband. So I'm like, yeah. gotta be eating. He's not my husband. He's my ex. But I'm gonna end this live, and I'm legit gonna send him the stream. So <laughs> everybody knows that you're like a lying piece of shit. No, <laughs> I can does not want anything to do with anyone on YouTube. I promise you. Oh no, I don't want people. Here's some receipts. That would be horrible. I, you want, I, I would advise her not. Liar. Here's you. some receipts, Lauren. You're a fucking liar. What? what do you want to show his penis? Like like and that's the show. last time you ever spoke to him. Michelle, she can't. The last time you ever contacted my ex husband. Last time I ever contacted your ex is over like custody dispute for the children. That's oh, nice. getting his kids. Okay, I'm gonna send this to him and then I'm gonna like replay our messages so it shows what a lunatic you fucking are. Yeah. <laughs> That's what what I are you doing? Kids. What are you doing there, Michelle? Are you going live to do that? What do you mean? What are you doing yeah, there? 18 hates kids. He fucking hates kids. You don't have <laughs> 18 hates oh, kids. He hates I kids. Wow, what kind of person hates kids? I mean, that's gonna be mean. 18 hates kids. I guarantee what? he did not get you knocked up, Lauren. The uh, twins, Michelle. Share the no. twins. Land. Don't know the twins, Lauren. Give me the kids. Give me a second. Yeah, show me. Show me pictures of you and Etienne. So what is the hostility all about, Michelle? No fucking idiot.
Like, Jeez, I'm being nice to her. And I was going to, like, be like, I don't, hey, what, what were you, exactly at what point do you think you were being nice to her? You were, like, for pretty much I was being very nice to her until she said that my ex-husband knocked her up and had twins. Yeah, where's the pictures, Lauren? Show you the pictures of your kids. Okay, here hear you now. We still see you, though. You look very nice. Show, show so, like, show my ex-husband with you birthing your twins okay. being there. What? Um, what do you, what do you mean? Say, like, my ex husband I wouldn't be there for their birth. Better. Um, yeah, no, our twins are for their birth. I've already shown pictures of them multiple times, and I'm really um, and I'm really happy that I have a nice sugar daddy supporting me now. So why do you live in an apartment with a roommate? Life style to keep my skin good and to give me chocolate so that I could be. That's why I'm so fat right now. It's so much fatter than you because of all the chocolates that he keeps sending me. I don't need chocolate. I don't need chocolate. I, no, I can hear you. Hold on. Let me test it. Like, come back in. There's something wrong with my audio. On the okay. She, you made her run away again, Michelle. Okay. She's a fucking liar. Like, we're we'll being invited to the. She's with my ex-husband. Yeah. Like, whatever. They're saying they're saying the, 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 you're over through my, my show. Michelle. This is not the new Michelle show. Is what someone's saying. Mm. Let's just have a no, peaceful one of your twins. And where's ATN during your birth? It's gonna be a delay. Because one, if he got you knocked up, he would have been there and stay with his mother. We can hear you. Someone type in chat. Entertaining. It's entertaining. Show me the twins. Not able to hear you guys. She can't hear us. That's crazy. Michelle, why would you want her to show pictures of her twins? That's kind of weird. You're always talking about liar. Like, Michelle, I remember. Psycho, and I was trying to be nice to you, but you're just proving your psychoness. Mm -hmm. She's proving she's a psycho right now. Hates kids. She's showing that she's a psycho. He was happy that I had a hysterectomy so that we would not have children. Etienne hates kids. But I don't think that she's claiming that. Hates, no, he hates kids. He doesn't like kids. He loves our kids, so Michelle. He loves he our kids. Show a picture of you in labor and delivery with my ex husband there. Okay, I will. I will show Do a it. picture. You guys see my now. coochie. And you're going to love it. Oh, well, well geez. Michelle, this is going to love that. Sure, Lauren. Show the picture of Etienne. Being in a labor and delivery room with you when you had twins for him, right? Well, you know this isn't quite like. Hey, um, why would she show that picture? Michelle? Why would she show that picture? That's a creepy she's a picture. Liar. She's never but, like, met my ex. Why do you find that picture like lying. a whore? That's not a cool I, picture to request. I just can't imagine being lying, called a liar because you're, you're, you're crazy. Can you prove oh, that she's no. lying, Michelle? That's like innocent until proven guilty. Can, she can you prove, prove that she's had kids from my ex-husband? You have to believe her until proven a liar. Is that that goes right? Twins don't run in his family at all. <laughs> Does he, I mean, first time for everything is what I heard. They could run in my family. You don't know. Look at my twins obviously run in my family. <laughs> twins are twins. Twins. They look good too. They do, don't they? Yeah, so I can yeah, no, no, Michelle. Oh, get out. I gotta get out of here. Hold on, okay. Hold on a second. I can't. No, I'm, get it. I'm sorry, Lauren. I gotta. I can't put her back on screen. I can't trust her. I just triggered my PTSD. Hey, Lauren, it was, it was my pleasure. I'm not bringing her back. You, I can't trade her. Uh, She's out of here. She's going to danger zone. You, you were great though. Thank you so much. You, do you need me to peace? No, I'll, I'll see you next time. I'll drop you and then to catch you on the next one, Lauren. It was my pleasure. You have a great time. Take care. Lauren Delagoon, everybody. Michelle goes live, tried to hit me with two. Hold on a second, Michelle, I got you. Watch this. I have a brown. I don't want to see. I got you. I don't want to see the tuna cans. Yeah, You're I have to a brown. You're going tuna can, tuna can crazy yeah, over there. I, I was just kidding. Tuna can titties. They're beautiful. I didn't mind uh, Lauren adjusting herself. That was, that, was, that was not bad. Yeah, my tuna can titties are beautiful. I'm not looking at those tuna cans, Michelle. They're not tuna cans. Yes, they are. Look. No, my no, goodness, no, no. Michelle. Jeez Louise. So desperate to show your tuna cans. You, you really want to give me a strike. I know what you're doing. Um, yeah, so Lauren was like leaning over, probably purposely showing her tits. Lauren was like, looking good, though, wasn't she, Michelle? Yeah, give a compliment. I did give her a compliment. I like got it like, you were, you, times until she said, If you were at the end, you were not. my ex husband. Oh, hey, yeah, I, I gotta go. See, I really gotta go. I, I gotta go. Have to go. I wouldn't let you show but the tuna can titties. That's so terrible of a disposition. Tuna can titties, I said you can't show them. Now you're gonna go. They're not tuna cans, dumbass. I have a bra on. Michelle just showed the tuna cans again. You pulled the bra back right when I right at the camera. Nice try. No, I didn't. Okay, bye. Yeah. Nice try. Bye. See you later. Nice yeah. I have plans. I, I gotta go. Oh, See you later. Yeah. I gotta be smart. Oh, I think you, did, you got a little perturbed to Lauren. She was demolishing you. Um, um, I was actually complimenting her. I see you trying to line up the tuna cans again. I'm not going for it. You were intimidated and you were very rude. You were rude and hateful and insulting and, and, and I was derogatory. Nice. I was like, hey, I'll no, the hell you weren't. As soon as you, as soon as you were reminded of the Etienne trying to dirty top your messages and, and then what hey, that ultimately like you like, went crazy. Bend you over and fuck you in the you ass until you bleed. You're not. You want to do what to me? I'm not in another. Etienne said that to Lauren. I'm, I'm not. Oh, and that boy made you feel like a boy. Etienne talked to Lauren like a fucking whore. He's like, I want to bend you over. And That's what like they were role playing. You've never heard of sexting or dirty talk, cyber sex, whatever the hell. He's not like that. He's. I know you're a little bit older. I mean, I'm old. That these kids have all kinds of apps. Michelle, Love that you. was terrible. Go, you were rude as hell and disgusting on Easter. Oh, get the hell out of here then. Disgust me. Get out of here. Go talk to the toast or whatever. Go text toast. Scram. My goodness. Sorry, I got a little wrapped up. Yeah, text an Easter egg. <laughs> Go and text the damn Easter egg, right? Get the hell out of here. I'm glad that I, I didn't have to even kick her. Ugh. Putrid coming up. What do you say? Yeah, I feel like I ended on a bad number, though. I don't want Easter to go like that. You yeah, go ahead if you I, want. She might not come up. I don't know. Go ahead and start. Like, did you have just like a word for it, maybe? Pardon? Come on, Michelle. I, I, I don't know if like you maybe had some words you wanted to get out from Michelle. Like, uh, yeah, I did. I do want to deeply apologize. Like, we were friends, so I do want to apologize for fucking her ex man. That's not nice. Oh, it's, and, it's really uh, and I shouldn't have done that. Like, clearly, she wanted kids of her own with him, and here I am living my best life. 
all um, fertile and young and just like being a sugar baby. Yeah. I mean, no, you can't really be held at, held at a fault. Like, it's not a bad thing for you. I should still apologize, though, you know? Like, <laughs> really friends. Like, you guys, hey, have come on. Yeah. <laughs> was it worth it or not? Because now you kind of feel bad for it's like me or you not. Um, was it worth it? Yeah, he wasn't like the best. You you could always do better than him. So uh, was it worth it? Probably not. But uh, it's worth it for the giggles, I guess, to make Michelle. Well, you guys, I'm, sure you guys, I'm sure he was very kind and generous in terms of like taking out places and doing fun stuff. Maybe gifts. I don't know. But like, oh yeah, oh, take yeah. care of his kids. Did he at least take care of his kids? Because Michelle, would have, you know, she, I do. She, I do take care of his kids. All of his kids are, you know, thriving. I remember Ski Mask was a little prodigy, and so he's um, an astrophysicist. What about, does he take care of his kids too? Like, does he help you out financially? Like, does he send money? No, I mean, like he he sends me money, but then in he makes me spend it on myself because I'm the sugar baby. He he doesn't like kids. So he, yeah, he refuses to let me spend that money on the kids. It's like kind of sad. Uh -oh. It really does help, you know, build my designer collection, which is nice. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. Whoa. Michelle, okay, come the fuck back. Why aren't you You're here excited. accepting my apology? Yeah, she's like hiding out in the chat like a little, like a weasel. What do you mean a weasel in the chat for Michelle? Also, where does she stream these days? She's on Rumble of all places, which is like some second tier nobody web website. And she tries to get people to pay five dollars a month to subscribe, which is I, I don't know, like just like a membership fee, like any other website. But you can watch. So you literally, so you can't watch unless you pay five dollars a month. You can't watch replays. You have to watch live. I think is how it works. There's no vods. Like you know how like our stream will end, and then a lot of people watch on the back end. Yeah. So the Clippers they get the clips, but like if you don't watch it live, then I don't think you can watch it unless you pay the five dollar fee a month. And I, I don't know if she makes up that number or what, but it's a, it's a bit of an extortion. It's a little strong arm. It's a little a little uh, you know, forward and, and bully like even for my 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 uh, type of maneuvers. Yeah. Michelle's like, pay five dollars just to watch. Like, uh, you know, come on now. <laughs> it's a bit off putting. Yeah, you, I mean, Michelle, like, if you could, would you uh, have a show with Michelle? I heard you ask her to be an interview or whatever. Would you offer that, uh, extend that invitation to her? Michelle has literally never been on my channel. Like, it's actually wild. She refuses <laughs> to come on my channel. I do think she's scared. Like, she's legitimately scared. Of of There'd be a lot of viewers for that show. Michelle probably don't want to give you that clout. I mean, it's so funny, like her giving me clout, considering the people that I hang out with now. She so, really. You know, in Michelle's brain, that's what she's thinking. Like, she don't want to give you that clout, like her little Michelle verse, <laughs> like the 500 or less, like the 200 extra viewers or whatever. You probably have about 300 viewers if you did it. That's like the size of the Michelle verse, and they're usually all all negative, you know, which is not good. I mean, they're not negative, like necessarily like evil, but you know, they're, they don't really like her a lot of them. That's what led her to leave YouTube, and now she has a regular job. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, just to address yeah, I, I don't know. I, I kind of feel bad, but I'm glad that she has a regular job. Do you think she likes the package cutting? No, she's 50 years old. She has to be hard on the body, too. Yeah, I, I thought she was in a, yeah. a her, wasn't she like a assessment the person? Like, yeah, what, that's a good question. I don't know what happened to that. Yeah, Michelle, what happened to the insurance job? That's a good question. She was reclining yeah, on she also, lied, she also lied about me cheating on the bar, but only in chat. Wild. Why, uh, didn't you talk to me? why didn't you talk to me about it, Michelle? And also, Dino Man, I see you. No, I clearly took a shower. That's why my hair looks different. I did not drink alcohol while I was gone. Um, I <laughs> no, damn. Your hair's looking a little Michelle like now. It's all like lost some of its volume. Is that what they're saying? It looks it's, nice to me. It's, it's, nice it's to me. no longer, um, it was like frizzy this morning and like dry. Oh, so like, good, good, yeah. yeah. You probably, yeah. Are you gonna go, what are you going to go do here in a little bit? Oh, uh, I think we have plans to. I think we actually have plans to go to Forte today. Um, if not Forte, some other restaurant. Um, I don't know which restaurant, but they're out there. Like, one of our friends is shooting pictures of another one of our friends for Instagram, so they're out doing that right now, and I could not bother. So like, uh, I'm in here. Like professional photo shoot, or like how did that go? What do they use? Like cameras or phones or? Well, I, yeah, we almost all of us use like prof like professional equipment now, just because of whatever. But they're so much bigger than I am, um, and they're more like Instagram people than uh, YouTube people. But I got like hundreds of thousands of followers or something on Instagram. Uh, let's. Mm, I don't I don't they, I know yeah, some of them have more than others. Um, some of them definitely have more than others. Are you, one, of these, is one of these YouTubers is the guy that you're engaged to. Is that like you don't have to say who? But I'm just curious. Is, it, is your guy known like publicly in your relationship? Uh, like, are we talking for real? These I'm not actually engaged, but I am talking to this guy, and okay. he is cute, and he has a house in Canada, and uh, I'm about oh. to go visit. No, it's not. No. You're doing a guy in Canada? Hold on. Is there one you Go. know? I know a lot of people. I know exactly who you're talking about. It all makes sense now. I know exactly his, who you're talking on, about. His online persona is called Audacious Cowboy. Um, he's just like this uh, entrepreneur. <laughs> like guy, Audacious Cowboy. Like a, is it really like, yeah? That's pretty cool. No, he's not. It's not a porno <laughs> thing. It's like a, he starts companies and stuff. <laughs> that's, not, that's not a porno guy. I think he's like getting paid to have sex and, you know, chicks look like you. No. no. Where's Michelle in chat? Which one is she under? 
I think she's actually Dino Man, honestly. I think, I think Michelle might be Dino Man, to tell you the truth. That can't be true because Dino Man was talking about how mentally fucked up Michelle is, saying, like, how can you pick on someone mentally ill? So she's giving herself false hate so she can react to it and bait sympathy. Ah. It's a big Lauren, you're purposely hurting someone who's struggling and being advantageous for what purpose? It's a joke. And then I it's a joke. And then I re yeah, and then I replied for the giggles. That's the purpose. Lauren, <laughs> do you not see how valuable you are? Yes, I'm very valuable at trolling Michelle. It's like one of my yeah. life skills. I think the best. You're better than even tragic. Like I think you get more riled up than even tragic. I don't know what it is about you. I think it's the fact that like you. I mean, tragic comes on camp too. I don't know. Just something about maybe it's a personal ATN claims. Yeah. Who knew? Who, um, who would expect her to be so uh, been out of shape about something her ex husband did? Isn't that her ex-husband? Like, why does she care? I wouldn't give a shit with my ex-girlfriend. I know I know ex-wife, but like, you know, I can't imagine it being much different. I don't give a shit with no ex exes did after I was done. Like, we left in part ways. Oh, yeah. Unless, like, yeah. Usually know, when like, my exes move on from me, I'm pretty relieved that, like, I'm not, <laughs> you know, like, if, if, I, I, if they were hurt, if they were hurt by the breakup, I'm pretty relieved that they, like, found some and found happiness elsewhere. You know what I mean? I'd, I got you. Don't want to be responsible. Yeah. yeah. No one didn't be unhappy because they stayed with you or something. Yeah, I get it. Like, you'd have yeah, so I don't know why she's not happy for me and Etienne for starting your life. Yeah. I think it has something to do with the stress of like always underneath uh, the possibility of losing the house. Like even though she's still in the house like a year and a half, two years later, it's still like can leave, lose it any day as soon as it gets sold. I think is the deal. I'm not sure on that exactly. She was trying to tell I'm you. Really, like, yeah, I'm really curious what's actually happening with that house. Like because there were so many YouTube rumors. It's in disarray. Like, in the last couple of days, she's in disarray. She's like got tables knocked over, and it's like she's like looks like she's putting holes in the walls in a couple. I don't know. It, it looks like a damn house that's under construction to be a house for sale soon. It's like one of those <laughs> brand new houses that they put like all the wallpaper and shit on yet. Yikes, that's embarrassing. Well, I hope yeah, she figures yeah. it out. I hope yeah. she gets her well, it was, Thank you for coming in. I appreciate it. If she comes Sorry back, uh, no problem. Bye. Have a good day. But I think more uh, person just showed up. She skirted out of here. What was she going to do? Hang out with some friends? What, 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 what are we? Chopped liver? I thought we were all friends. Excuse me, Michelle. Jeez, I thought I was your friend. Dino Man. That was an exception right there because we were born again. Thank <laughs> you.